Hello, ladies and gentlemen of the internet, Daddy Davis here, dropping video 3 hot like a mixtape. In today's video, I'm going to tell you a story of something that happened pretty recently, and that is how I got suspended from the last week of school. So it was Monday, the beginning of the end. I was walking to 8th period with my friend, let's call him Bean. So we had math lab together, because when it came to math we were both retarded, but I had to use the restroom, so I went to the restroom. As I was going towards there, I saw two of my other friends, so me and my other friends went to the bathroom. As I entered, there were the 7th graders throwing soap, being the usual faggots they are. So they all ran out, scot free, because in my school apparently I'm the kid you just don't mess with, I guess. So they all run out, and we walk out because we don't want to get in trouble because, obviously, you, you, you can't put cameras in the bathroom. But, what do you know, we all walk out, and the janitor, who I've had issues with before, automatically just blames us and tells us to get to class. So, we do. Not even five minutes in a class, the principal stops by my class and pulls me out, and of course I'm the first one he pulls out. Then he pulls out my other friends, and quote-unquote asks me if I did it or not. You know, asks, or like, accused, no, 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 He asked us, he asked us. But, so he, he asked, like, me, like, just me, like, five times, and by the fourth time he asked me, I, I, I respond all shitty, and like, going around on how I'm in eighth grade, and how he thinks I'm throwing soap. So, after that, he sent us back to class, and I walk in all fired up, and I sit on the back counter of the class, and the girl on the computer asks me what happened, and I stupidly and loudly say, these stupid fuckers accuse me of throwing soap in the restroom. Now, this is a guide. Just don't talk smack about anyone, to anyone ever. Just, just keep it in your mind, okay? I regret that decision very much. So, let's just guide a guide to survive. But. So, the teacher hears me and sends me down to the office, and my principal, madder than ever, invites me. You know, nice little invitation to his room and shuts the door and goes off. By the end, he's chill and drops the bombshell of I'm suspended for the rest of the year. I was happy but mad at the same time, I could say. I was happy because I didn't have to take finals, a huge sigh of relief. And I never have to see any of the teachers there again, a bigger sigh of relief. Again, because I'm moving on to high school, not not because I'm never going to that school again, well, yes, but it's not like I got expelled or anything, because I'm moving on to high school. But I was mad because last year I smoked in school and only got suspended for one day. Yep, for one day. For lighting up in the bathroom. I got suspended for one day. Which made no sense, because I got suspended for calling a staff member a name for a whole week. Also, I was also a little frustrated because I knew I was going to get grounded and had to do child labor, but I only got grounded for two weeks and I had to do mild child labor. So, this has been the story and how I got suspended. I'm Daddy Davis, and I'm out. And so I just wanted to apologize for my lack of uploads. I've been very busy in my life. And a lot has been going on. I've been trying to upgrade my PC and my mic, so it is a more enjoyable experience for you guys, but uh, a lot of things have gone wrong. Um, the license for my uh, program to edit my videos and to render it and to make it look the way it looks and everything to... Well, the trial ran out, so I had to renew that. So that took a while, and also, I've just been lazy off my ass to do anything really, um, but besides that, there's no excuses, but I just want to say that I am back, and I will see you in the next one.